Be hitting the loud pedal and then trying to slap the brakes into that first turn. Here we go. All right. Let's get ready to rumble. One light, two lights, three lights, four lights, five lights. And it's lights out and away. First corner. We Matt will get the upper hand. And I think I saw an Alpha Tower spin, but uh, I might be wrong. But the Alpha Tower leads the race. That incident. Uh, I think there was some sort of album move being made. And uh, sadly, both of them have to pit for new wings. Yes, it is. Uh, that generally the first yeah, first lap. What's crucial for Doug Falcons is that he has the tire to attack like the, the way he did in the first lap. But it's also crucial to remember that Doug Falcons tires will have the outside of Silex on the medium tires. No, Silex on the soft tire. Sorry. Uh, no, he yeah. And he made that move stick from what it looks like. Almost there side by side now. The McLaren. Right, Danza still, well, he didn't gain or lose any positions, but he's still side by side. He does not want to be there at the moment, but he got the inside and he needs to get this move done. And I think at the moment you want to be back at a Falcon, wouldn't you? Oh, look at this. Everybody else yeah. coming to join the party in the background there as well. Give us a good camera angle there, please, Cody. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Always switches to the wrong camera at the wrong time. I mean, we're getting battles right front and center at the moment, and I expect these drivers to be at their very best. Uh, I don't know if we're overtaking them. So, a lot of uh, sweaty drivers uh, on the grid will probably have uh, done the qualifying, and uh, they're probably at their very best. Oh, it's going to be brave to go on the outside there. He had to lift off a little bit. Let's compromise it. And that's, oh, that's a priori of EDU going completely around. So he's actually just hit the power too much, loud pedal, and that car's just not cooperating. I think some of these drivers might be praying for a safety car right now, if you are. Oh, the soft tyres, sorry. I've been speaking too much lately. <laughs> Great camera angle there as they all go through the last corner down the main straight. DRS enable for a lot of these drivers. As you can see, they're all within that gap. And looks, Jacob looks slowest. As a, I think it's lost. Oh, a collision there, right there between the Alpine of Cyclex and Jacob is slowest. And then all of a sudden they've spoiled it and gave me a wrong camera angle. But look at that, Dougie Falcons is dropping out to Flavio. Yeah, so, this is uh, the time where uh, the tire uh, is he's not out pretty quickly. I don't think a front wheel change, front wing. So he's elected to go onto the softs. Started on the mediums, but he's going to have to box again for sure, wouldn't he? Yeah, but big oh. enough, Dougie Falcons has been a bit inconsistent lately, and Acti have so as well. So this is the time. We're going to try to start fighting for the big points. And we'll see if uh, if there will be any Max Verstappen versus Sam Turley. Like, I feel like Flevo is going to try to pull away. And Dougie Falcons will be left on. going to hold off here. Knowing these tyres are, are much, much fresher than the softs. EDU wants to get past him as quickly as possible. Lap 12. I mean, the soft runners can not He's enough for a lot of drivers because usually... No, it's not very often that you do start on fresh boots, so... No, I mean, that's the downfall of uh, restarted lobbies, something that we wrestlers really need to get. This is going to be the chance, I think, for an undercut. We'll have a look. It can pay dividends for you if you get it right. We'll see, in and out. Here, yeah, about 18 seconds. Pretty quick quick pit stop, 80 km an hour. Ooh, I think you have a tank slap touching the wall on the, on the exit. So that's very interesting. Uh, Hamilton. <laughs> yeah. So what's going to happen? Oh, Acti, a championship contender. Oh, big lockup. Oh, <laughs> Lucky he didn't get caught speeding in the pit lane. That's one that really hurts you, doesn't it? He must have got damage. That's well. very unfortunate. Oh, I say he has damage because he just boxed, remember, that lap or so before. Is that front yeah, wing change? Front I think he's got yeah. the right strategy here. But remember, he also has to make his tyres go to the end. Ah, uh, there will be no issues. I mean, we're pretty much almost halfway. Yeah, come so to speak of the man, is uh, just got past Alfie, who's still on those uh, original tyres to start the race on. Yeah, I'm just thinking. Right on the outside what... here, and he has. I saw Mercedes on the inside, and I got PTSD flashbacks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that I, corner I, as well. I was going to spy back in. Mad Girl is now boxing our leader from a comfortable lead as well. And let's have a look if Falcon has responded to this. We'll keep an eye on the pit stop. There's no front wing change there. Coming out of the pits, there's Dougie. Look at this. Dougie's done it. 
Dougie has done this on strategy. He's gained the lead. He's shaved eight or so seconds it was, I think. But Madwell Gamer now is going to have some fresh boots. This is going to be spicy. I've known Dougie for a couple of years, but he's been, told me, you told me the other day he's been racing for some time. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, racing, yeah, yeah. but yeah. in this league. Oh, yeah. Exactly. And Madwell is... Oh, uh, sorry. Young, 21 lap hard tyres. He's going to get rid of them for sure now. 19 for voids. Yeah. So I think this might be the restart if the Should be. Red Bull and McLaren manage to Certainly catch up. You've got cars left, right, and center all around you. I'm really looking forward to this restart. And Madwell looks like he's already going. No, nope. now he's going. And Flevo already being put under pressure so behind Flevo. And there looks to be another retired car. And that's the Red Bull. Uh, but there is no safety car as of yet. They're still racing. Fuck is getting... track right now. Isaiah, it's Flavo getting his penalty. I knew that was going to happen. That's going to get a bit more breathing space for Dougie. Oop, I just switched away at the very long, wrong, wrong moment. I do apologize about that one. Just yet. Yeah. It's already spicing it up. Imagine what's going to happen when DRS is enabled. Exactly well, what the South African driver has done. Here's a run from Carlos and Colin up in the same way. Come on, camera angle is blocked by the advertising. Dougie had to clear him. He had to clear him, Flavio, doesn't he? Because Dougie's not yeah, thinking yeah. about P2. Dougie wants a P1. He doesn't want to let the Mad Wolf get away. He's a man on a mission. I, uh, I actually made a deal with Alfie coming out of the corner. He might actually be compromised by voids. Great wheel-to-wheel -wheel racing just in the background. It looks like also Edio and Carlos are going for it. Two for now. Yeah. Uh, I'm, yeah. Uh, I'm currently on board with Flavio uh, and jump back into... Uh, oh, sorry. This is speed from Alfie. Back. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's a massive spin, and that's cost oh, any potential of in this championship with four laps to go. And, you know, the top ten are separated by ten seconds. So and it's going to cost you a lot. Cost by side with Alfa Romeo around the inside. Void locking up a bit. Is, uh, is Dougie just playing it safe right now? Has he just said, I don't want that helmet anymore? If I beat, if I win the championship, Madwell, and just giving up the fight to Madwell and just bring the car home? I don't know. <laughs> No, uh, I was actually about to make, uh, made Dougie Falcon just sitting duck, uh, especially since the cars behind him has DRS. So I guess he's just been pushing too hard on those soft tires to catch up to Madwell Gamer. Nice than Gon Sander is, but at this point on the penultimate lap, it ain't going to make any difference, is it? So. Yeah, Acti has now started to push as well to get out of that DRS because I think he suspects. So that is penalties. We don't need to see the tires. It's your fastest lap currently. Dougie Falcon. Oh, there's a tap there between both the Alpha Tar, oh, the teammates. They're taking each other out. The Alpha Tories of Carlos and Voids. Oh, that's going to be disappointing. They're both in the points, and that's not oh, a very maybe not so. sitting at the same table. <laughs> what happened? Uh, yeah, the Alpha Romeos did not expect that. Uh, it's been a quiet race for them, but suddenly it all goes downhill. Uh, so, Stuff. yeah. I, and then a disaster scenario, obviously, from the Alfa Romeos. And Molly bringing that car home and that sporting that new livery for the Red Bull in the Red Bull Arena, unfortunately. Has to finish last place, but still, finish. Well, what a drive for sure. Spray that champagne, my friend. South African man is definitely in town and definitely in this series for sure. Third podium in a row for this man. We're going to get interviews for him, no doubt, soon.